Hey guys, Odie Rex here. I'm showing you how to make an intro in Buff Tyler. So let me just size this up. Alright. So uh, when you open up Buff Tyler, it's a pretty old program, but it's pretty useful. So so you'll start if you press Pro, you can keep that if you want. So if you do want that one, just click on this and then just change the name, whatever. But I'm gonna show you how to make one from like scratch. So press, uh, you show yes. Just okay, all right. Start off something like this. You can just change text. I'll just put hello. All right. So you can put. Find one that you'd like. So if you like that one, you you can keep it. That was string. That's string two. String three. So you can just pick one of these. See if you like that. Whatever you want. So just pick one of these. Uh, kind of fonts, not really. I'm just gonna find one that I like. Whatever, I like that one for say. So keep that one. All right. So you'll start off with three seconds. If you want more, press insert time ten times to add one more second. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So then you'll have four seconds. I'm just gonna add five seconds. All right. So I have five seconds. Let's start. So at the start of your uh, timeline, zero, 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 zero. Just pull it back till you cannot see it so about there and uh, and just uh, go to where you want it to zoom in I'll put two seconds I want it right there all right so I got that now you want to put more effects when it kind of zooms in so about here I'll turn this oh. I'll turn this halfway move in turn this halfway and then right maybe around here I'll put it to the top so what, what I got is just this text zooming in like that if you don't like that just delete timelines and click undo if you want it's so the arrow right here all right so now that you got your text, kind of zooms in like that. Now you just want to add some effects onto it. So just click on this little uh, A logo and put, uh, click any one of these. I'll take Sparkle 2. So I like this one, so I'll just zoom in. It'll start sparkling like that. And then let's add a background. So you'll no, let's add add a particle here and pick any one of these you want. Spark field. So how it kind of matches the text because it sparks. Uh, you can add a background if you want. That's mainly all I can show you. You can add a background if you want again choose your own or you can choose buff titlers alright now let's if you like this if you like this then I'll sh to render it go to file export as movie uh, file format on compressed AVI advanced include last frame uh, frames per second 29.97 and quality put it to shader AA that's what I found worked best for me so thank you for watching OJ Bricks here uh, subscribe rate comment and like this video uh, my giveaway will be in the description my iPhone 4 giveaway and some other how to make an in how to make intros in like Sony Vegas or Sony 4D and my Twitter Facebook and blog will be in the description thanks for watching bye